guys, Gordon Ice here, back with more Madison in the building. Man, listen. <laughs> this game here is something else, man. Uh, but I'm enjoying it so far. So we've, what, we'll, what we figured out in the last episode is that there was a police officer that found the well, that went down in the well, that tried to figure out what was going on. They found the bodies of people who had been dismembered. Something happened. She saw someone or something in the well and something happened and somehow we ended up here. Whatever that thing or person was catapulted us in this place that we're in now and I have no idea what happens from here. Anyway, guys, if you've been enjoying my playthrough of Madison, do me a favor. Hit the subscribe button for me if you would and let me know how you found my channel. Um, I'd be great, greatly appreciate it. Now, I guess it doesn't really matter which one of these doors we open. So I'm just going to spin myself around and just pick one at random. So let's, let's go with this one. Okay. Well, I guess we can open them all. They all look the same. I don't think there's one any better than the other. But I'll open them all just for grins. Now, what? Why would that happen? Oh! Okay. I admit that got me. You got me. You got me. I jumped a little bit. <laughs> you got me. So, all of them are locked now? I can't open any of them. Lock. 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 Locked. 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 Okay, what am I supposed to do then? What is, what is one supposed to do with this? They're all coming out from under this door. I mean, but what does it matter? Maybe I just need to take a picture of it. Oh! Yep. That, that's, that's it. That is it. <laughs> that's it. It's, it's just a picture of a door. I don't know that we really need that stuff. Need these, these, these. Oh wait, so we. Oh, we can get out of here. I can't say that I'm any closer to figuring out what we're supposed to do. I'm, just, I'm just not. But we do have this, this other. Come on, bro. Really? Really? Oh! Why well, I got somebody grandma I'm a peeking on me? Peeking in on me? Is that my grandma? Lucas' grandma? It would, you know, this is, this is totally unrelated, right? But every time I press the... Damn. Uh, my aunt. Come on, man. Keep it together. Yeah, oh, I'm not with the ringing ears. I don't. I don't know, man. I was just gonna say it's funny that right in that. Mo oh, open the notebook. Okay. Interesting. Um, I was just gonna say right at that moment, like when you uh, on the PlayStation Five, when you press the left trigger button to pull the camera out, how the haptics in the trigger like pushes your finger back I, sometimes I don't like that uh, it gives you the feeling like you're you're doing something wrong um, it's kind of hard to explain uh, but anyway all right so we have to figure out now how to get to the attic and I have not seen I have not seen anywhere remotely that would tell me how to get there all this stuff is locked. This still has, is it 9.05? Is that what the time? Nine? No. Nine o'clock and seven seconds. I just have to put that to memory. Um, oh. Just, just as I said something about not knowing where the attic was. Well, up we go, ladies and gentlemen. 
There's nothing else we can do anyway. Okay. I don't know why addicts always have to be scary, bro. They always have to be scary. Um, okay. This is huge. I've never been here before. Uh, me neither. Why are there mathematic equations all over the wall? I don't like the sound of that. Let's start with this. Is this grandparents again? It's on the back. Age is just a number you can add or subtract, but at the end of the day, when the time comes, you die anyways. Wow, how morbid. Jeez. I mean, it's true, but you don't have to say it like that. It's just weird. Okay, what do we have here? That is, I can't, I gotta walk around it to get to it. Oh, we do have this. Would this help? Nope. What about the hammer? Nope. Okay, so whatever that is, I don't have. So I need something for the wall over there. Something for this bed, or at the foot of the bed. What is this? Another key. It's just got a heart on it. Okay. And there's another place for a painting here. How much stuff is in my inventory? We're full. Okay, I'm gonna have to take something back. Okay. All right, I guess I guess I need to do that uh, really quick. There's a clock here that I'm guessing we need to hang somewhere. Uh, yeah, okay, let me do this, guys. I'm gonna take a quick second to take some stuff back. Uh, I'll be right back. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw a woman was killed by a police, killed a police officer. The 43 by a police officer. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw a woman was killed by a police, killed a police officer. The 43 police officer. The phone is ringing? Are you kidding? 43 year old was killed by the police. Was it the police officer that went down in the well? Let's go answer this phone. Did it stop ringing? Voicemail. First of all, uh, for those of you who don't know, this is, this is actually a Nortel phone. I know that because I work on phones. This is a Nortel phone. There's no way that this Nortel phone would be inside this house because you need a phone system in order for that to work. I know you guys don't really care about that stuff, uh, but it is facts. <laughs> it is facts. All right, so we got to store some stuff here. Um, I guess let's start with... Uh, let's start with this. And... Uh, I guess we need that. That and that. Okay. All right, let's make our way back up. Uh, I, I was supposed to skip all of this, but, you know, with the with the TV jumping on the way it did, I was like, well, I don't want you guys to miss anything. Um, I'm, I try to do really good about that. Uh, yeah, I don't want you guys to miss any aspect of this game uh, to the best of my ability. All right, let's go back up here uh, and figure out what exactly we're supposed to be doing up here. Okay, so there is, we have this here, a clock here. No, I don't imagine we would do, I don't think that sun medallion works on that. I can try later though. Uh, picture goes there. Okay. Now this is clearly on the wrong wall. What's that? This is clearly on the wrong wall. So let's let's take this one. Question mark. Uh it should go, I'm guessing, over here. Mm-hmm. No. I don't want to grab it. What is what is the stuff that I'm hearing in here? What is this? 43. 43. OK. 
Okay. 43. I don't guess we don't have anything for this. Yeah, but what was the point of that? 25? Okay. Why does that matter? 43, 25. What? Okay, it's a painting that goes there. Oh, wait. I didn't see that. The shape of this portrait mm -hmm. is quite strange. It is. But it should go here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There was something on that. Uh, Giovanni Maxwell, 56 years old. No, brother. We want, Yeah, we want to put it there. Okay. So does that mean there is a circular portrait somewhere in here? Let me try to take a look around. Um, um, where would there be a circular portrait? I'm not, I'm not seeing one. Just some, this, whatever this is on the floor, but I can't, I mean, none of this stuff is gonna work for that. Okay, so then I'm guessing this key, this key should unlock whatever I need to do this part, I guess. Uh, let's head back down. There's nothing more we can do up here. That I can tell. There's a portrait there too. Okay. Now what would this key possibly unlock? Let's try this room over here. This one maybe? Nope, I don't even get the thing for it. Okay. How about this room over here? <laughs> That'll do it. Okay. Now what's in here? Mmm. It's <laughs> Ace Ventura would say. A lovely room of death. Should be somewhere. A lovely room of death. This is another cassette tape. There are no. meds everywhere. Guys, can you do me a favor and look up to see if this is if this is an actual medication? Uh, I crawls repents. I don't know what that is. See if that's an actual medication. All right, what's over here? More of the same. Why would he keep all this? Grandma medication died for cataracts? a long time ago. Okay. Huh. I mean, like there are medications everywhere. Look at that. Look at this. Just peels and peels everywhere. Okay, what's in this armoire? Anything? A book? Grandma's diary. Can we read it? Okay, let's read it. March 22nd, 1972. They say that having a diary is good for the brain. Well, we'll see how this goes for me then. Uh, a few days later, today we went to a garage sale near the center. Uh, I found a book of very good recipes. Johnny came back happy with the book too. I was very excited about it. It was a good day indeed. Okay, very good. Uh, three days later, I woke up in the middle of the night. Again, I swear there was something staring at me in the corner of the room. Great. Uh, two days later, today I found all my jewelry scattered all around the room and my wedding ring inside the kitchen sink. Note to self. I asked Johnny what he was looking for, but, but he swears he didn't touch a thing. We had to bring Johnny to our bed once again. The book we brought, the, the book we bought him only causes him nightmares. We have to admit uh, that it is a little scary though, okay? 
Uh, all of my jewels out of place again. I cannot find my wedding ring. It was the cutest gift Albert ever gave me. But today Johnny wasn't at home. Sometimes I feel as if uh, there was someone else in the house watching every step I make. Albert tells me not to worry. He he might think I'm starting to go crazy. What a relief. I found the ring in John's room. Honestly, I don't know what to think. Uh, I didn't get any sleep last night. I could not get that stupid tale of the eyeless monster out of my head. I don't know why we bought we bought him that stupid book. Uh, this is almost a month later. I haven't written for a long time. These weeks have been, I've been from a doctor to another. Something is wrong with my eyes. They don't know, they don't know what's happening to them. My sight is getting blurrier each day and it hurts a lot. Uh, a few day, a few weeks later, God, doctors say that I've lost more than 40% of my sight in these last weeks. I find it hard to read, write, watch TV, even think of other things. My pupils are kind of erasing from my eyes. So uh, it's the 22nd, the very next day. I'm tired of medications. Nothing seems to help. I cannot stand the pain anymore. Why is this happening to me? It's extremely hard for me to move around the house with my eyes like this. Uh, I cannot stand the pain anymore. God, please. God, help me, please. Uh, I'm really scared. I know there's someone in the house, but nobody believes me. I know it's true, even though I cannot see it. I feel the presence. There's someone living among us. Uh, the very next day, I know there's someone in the house. I heard noises all night long. I swear. I heard someone breathing while trying to get a glass of water. I lost more than 80% of my sight. Doctors say there's no longer, they no longer see any solution. I don't want to be in this house anymore. I'm not safe here. Uh, last one, my ring is out of place again, but it doesn't matter. Nobody would be able to find it now. I just hid it underneath, underneath what? Am I supposed to take this? No. Hit it underneath what? What did you hide it underneath, Grandma? Okay. Another thing is, is that I'm. Why? Why are all the pictures taken off the wall? She was so sick. Oh, I guess this is a picture of her eyes. Uh, let's read this. Uh, June 26, Elizabeth Maxwell, ocular depth exam, cataracts diagnosis. Strange type of cataracts. Both eyeballs are turning completely white. The patient loses her sight progressively in short periods of time. Ocular damage, percentage right eyes, 95% left eyes, 87. We cannot define neither assure what, we cannot define neither assure what is happening with the patient's eyes. Please continue with medication as, uh, as up to date while we find a proper treatment. Next visit, July 26, 1972. So that would explain, that's locked. That would explain why, the, yeah, see, why the pictures of her don't have any pupils because she started to lose her eyesight. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, what's in here? That side is locked. What do we have here? What are these uh, things? These are slides, my friend. They are slides. We're going to take them. Oh, we got to save for that. It's not good. That is not good. Okay. Okay. Oh, we got another save in the bottom. Ah, uh, it's not good. That is not good. Oh, so this is where the sun, where the med okay. Well, we only have one. Okay, I guess I just, I need to go back in. This looks like some type of contraption here. Yeah. This is a contraption here to slide this out of the way. There's something back there. Okay. Okay. All right, let me let's let's go back. Let's go get the um the medallion. We only got one. So I'm not sure yeah, let's just, let's go in here. Uh, how many things do I have? Okay, I got plenty. I got plenty. Uh, let's get this, get that, that coin out of here. Uh, here. Okay. Maybe self-explanatory. I don't think I only need one. Yeah. It just, it just have to put it in the right way. So let's make our way back over here. Let's go back in here. 
and we're gonna put this in That's not right. What? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. I don't remember picking that up. What? That's not right. See, that's a, that's a symbol of an earth right there. So this can't be it. No. Okay. No, let me grab that back. This one is right. That's right. I don't even remember picking that medallion up, guys. To be quite honest. Okay. So we have these slides. I don't recall seeing anywhere where I can use them. What is, it, what, is, what does that even mean? You know? That song. Um. Where's the statue? Oh, great. Just great. It's the, the statue's just up and left. How does that happen? What? It's open now. Look at all these pills. Look at all these pill bottles. someone here. There's a tape on the floor. Why can't I pick it up? I, I can't pick it up. Why can't I? Why are you here? Oh, Lord have mercy. Okay, we got it. Okay. You know what? Before we even, we even we even entertain that, right? I'm gonna go back here, <laughs> and we are going to play this and figure out what this is. What this is? Okay. Tape number two. Let's play it. Becoming possessed by a wicked entity is signified by a loss of control over the body mind and the soul however that is often not enough for the entity it hungers for more things get much worse for the host in these cases possession is just the first step of the demon's plan it is said there are those that return to our world seeking to resolve unfinished matters from their mortal lives the victims of these wicked possessions are subjected to a departure of sorts. An astral transportation, for lack of a better word. An astral what? These malicious beings force their hosts to, to live moments that shouldn't be possible in a different place and time, perhaps even in a different dimension altogether. It's madness. It's unclear whether these transportations occur inside the mind or if the host is physically taken to some alternative reality. Alternative reality? I'm losing my mind. You are not alone, sir. You are not alone. Okay, we're going to store this tape uh, and then we're going to head back over there. Okay, almost back to where we were picking up the tape and let's see what we gonna see down here um, it says this is locked this thing slid back I guess it's gonna move again yep. I, I anticipated that Whoa. okay Stop 
this? Yeah, let's 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 cool out on that. That's a whole that's a whole lot going on. Okay, and now it's gone. Great. Just great. That piano is blocking the front door. Of course it is. This this house is awkwardly made. That you know what I mean? Statue. What's wrong am with the I, statue? Am I going insane? Man, I I don't know. I have no idea. I have no idea. Oh, I guess this is where we need to use the slides. Yeah. We have lots of v, v, uh, VHS tapes over here. What y'all know about VHS? Okay, well, I'm just going to go over here. Uh, yeah, because why not? Okay. Let's put in the slides here. Uh, where are they? Here. One, two, three, four, five, six slides. Okay. That one looks unremarkable. Next. Grandma. Grandma, why are there... What is this? Grandpa never got over her death. Elizabeth Maxwell, 1968. Okay. All right. Let's change it. Is he sitting down? Is he sitting on the ground, I guess? Okay. This Dad. Why is the statue here? That's kind of strange, isn't it? It's a little weird. Okay. Okay. These photos are pretty old. They are. I'm not sure which is the right one. Maybe that one? Like, does it even matter? You know what I mean? What is happening? Why is it doing that? It's, it's doing it on its own. There's a medallion on the wall, I think. It's just flickering so fast. What is that? Why is that little spinning thing there? Am I supposed to take a picture of this? Let's try it. Oh! Only thing that made sense. Only thing that made sense. Oh, look at that. Okay, well let's at least pick this one up. That's the earth and the moon, I think. Yep, it's uh, Venus and Mercury. I'm sorry. Okay, we got it. Yeah, that was the only thing that made sense. Only thing that made sense. Okay. Wait, that lightning. All right, then. Then there's something down here too. A clock. Clock? Is this a clock? The shadow doesn't make it look like one. So creepy, bro. Look at this thing. Yeah, it's like you can't you can't use these medallions, so I'm not sure. I haven't figured out yet how to open those. Oh, look at here. Grandpa's office. Yeah. Okay. If you need the combination, you know where to find it. I don't know that I do. What? 
Oh, of course he's gone. Or it's gone. Wait a minute. Joseph Abraham Lexter, I rerunned uh, the, the correction of contact. Oh man, that's a lot of that's a long number. Liar. Okay. There's another safe down here. I don't know what that what that might be. There's nothing in there. How to contact the dead. All this time. We thought he went mad. But he only wanted to talk to her again. What is this? Instructions for silver locket. A photo of the required to let us okay. okay. What is this? I think I know where this goes. Does it just go upstairs? I'm not sure what that means. Why, bro? Why? Why? Are you kidding? Wait a minute. Why would you slam the door on me? <sighs> this game is so unsettling and unnerving. Okay. Alright, well, you can stay in there. I'm, I'm going this way. You can have that room. You heard me? You can have it. Come on, bro. Just let me be. I just, I just let me be. Still locked. Okay. I think... I believe... That... I think we got the medallion we need for this. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. Yeah, so we got this one, I think. Oh, but I don't know which one goes where. 33 years ago. Oh. No, no. Not that one. This one. I guess that's right. I don't think Neptune goes in between this. That, that wouldn't make sense, but we'll try it anyway. Yeah, that doesn't that doesn't that doesn't quite make any sense. Let me get that back. Okay. Alright, what we need where we need to go now is back up to the attic and use this picture upstairs. Yeah, this game reminds me a lot of Visage, man. A lot of Visage. I, I have to, and maybe I just need to play the game a little bit longer. Um, but Visage is a is is a is a bit scarier than this. Um, but I don't want to complain. <laughs> I don't want to complain. All right, let's put this painting here. Let's see. Okay. Does, does that do anything? I don't think. Yeah, none of, none of this stuff works here. Oh no! With the statue again? But nothing is any different. Oh, we need a painting for that too. Yes, we do. Okay. I don't know why this is here. I don't think this does anything. No. Okay. So clearly we need to figure out the combination to that safe then. Uh, which I admittedly don't know. Off the top of my head, it's saying if you know... You know, if you need the combination, you know where to find it. Uh, this was 43, but there's no numbers on it. There are no numbers on the, on the, 
on the um on the dials. Hmm. Yes, yeah, so that's that makes this a little bit confusing because for you to tell me that I know where to find them, I actually don't know where to find them. To tell you the truth. But I think what I'm gonna do, guys, we're gonna get back here and Okay, it won't play now. We just fine by me. That is that is absolutely fine by me. This you can't interact with anymore. There's nothing else down here. From what I can tell. Nope. There's nothing on these shelves. I can't interact with these clocks yet. I don't I don't even know. I don't even I don't even know. I have no clue. And like I said, um, yeah, like I, I, I don't see, yeah, cause see, like I said, there, there, there are no numbers. Uh, if you need the combination, you know where to find it. I have no idea what that means. I don't know. I don't have a clue. Where would I find it? And then there's another one down here. Like none of this makes any sense. It's a bunch of numbers on that. It doesn't make any sense at all. And that's empty. Well, guys, I, I guess from here, this is where we're going to have to... St Wait a minute. It is red, so does that... No. I thought I thought that might have provided something additional. But no. None of, the, none of these do. Okay. Um... This isn't anything either, I'm sure. Okay. All right, guys. I'll tell you what. When we come back, I'm going to try to see if I can figure out uh, how to solve the the combination for these. Because right now, I, I really don't have a clue. Um, but I will figure it out. I will figure it out. I don't know if it has to do with that stopwatch that we found. It was like 9. It was 9. It was 9. I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. All right, guys, come on back next time. We'll play some more of this Madison. Do me a favor, if you would, please uh, consider subscribing to my channel. It would really mean a lot to me uh, if you guys would do that. Uh, let me know how you found my channel, if you enjoy my gameplay and playthrough. Remember, this is a blind playthrough, guys, so I'm figuring this out as I go. Uh, I think that makes for a more interesting playthrough, right? Instead of you know everybody always knowing what to do and where to go, I think that kind of makes the game boring. You don't get general reactions from people if they always know what to do. Um, and this is just how I play, right? Uh, but anyway, guys, it's going nice, man. I'm taking a break here. I will see you guys next time. Take it easy, and I will see you again soon. Later.